So, we're where again? Uh, we're in Kramer. Kramer. Oh. So, we're in Kramer. Near and Boron. Mark's eating a Subway sandwich. He's bathing in it. And we somehow managed to pack the car. It was like Tetris, but beyond all this stuff, like beyond the protective yellows, we've got all of our deltas. We're stopped at Starbucks in Techa Happy, which is like a little mesa in between Mojave and uh, the great California Valley. Um, Sarah went into the Starbucks to get a cinnamon dolce mocha fucka something. <laughs> so it should be delicious. So I'm waiting in the car and getting hot and uh, can't wait to have a coffee drink from Starbucks. Hello. Talk to me. Hi. We're here at Maker Fair. We're alive. They let us drive our car all the way into the building and we're going to set up now. It's going to be awesome. All the babies made it. And we're in the dark room right on top of the stage. That's like, yeah. So apparently I'm going to be forced to get over my fear of Tesla coils this weekend. So we were able to get another table so that you don't have to worry about these sliding off the front when we prop them up. We also have our stash down here. What are you working on? I am putting gaff tape on my little name badge so that I can write Sarah in neon yellow and it will glow in the dark. We're all set up now. They really like you. I don't know if I got her. Hit, just hit her in place. minutes until um, they let people in and the raping commences but um, everything's set up they look nice nothing was missing when we got here we've had our coffee and we have our hearing protection and we're ready to go so yeah <laughs>
All right, so you get 10 points if you can put a pony sticker on one of those Tesla coils. Yeah? Shit. behind me but I don't care. We're alive still. We're alive. Busy but really good. Day one at Maker Fair. So, we're having a blast, but we're exhausted, and uh, we're about the last hour of doing this. So we're uh, hoping to wrap this up soon. But we had a blast. This is a really fun day. There's our kids. All right, so where are we? We're at some Irish pub in San Mateo. We're at the. Uh, at the Hackaday, the Hackaday. Uh, meet up. So this is uh, day one of the Maker Fair. Um, Saturday, we've been at the Maker Fair for over 10 hours today. And uh, here we are enjoying our beer. And uh, hopefully we can get home at some point and catch enough sleep to do all of this again tomorrow. <sighs> okay, so it's Sunday and um, we're in our booth, which is that big gray lump back there. Um, we're about to set up. We're um, drinking um, large amounts of coffee, which they have for free right now outside. So once we have energy and stuff, we're gonna start preparing for another full day of um, being encroached upon by uh, zombie children. I kind of got over my fear of letting people control my children, so that's the flock of people that's uh, kind of around our booth right now. Um, they seem to be holding up pretty well, so I'm not too worried about it as of right now. Um, if the crowd gets too big or we start having issues with the robots, we're going to pull the connect back in the booth, but for now it's alright. Maker Fair. We're live still. Just a few hours to go. And then the robots we... are working really well. And then I get to go see cuttlefish, so I'm excited. We're going to uh, the Monterey Aquarium tomorrow. Yes. And the. You get to see calamari before it's calamari. No. <laughs> it's me. Bad. Delicious. We did it. It's over. And everyone's packing yeah. up and they turn the lights on and Mark's getting the car and we're gonna go get beers now and I'm so happy. And all of the robots, I'm happy to report, made it through the entire fair without any mechanical issues. So no joints popped apart and we didn't have to replace any arms. So I'm a happy camper, which means these things are ready to ship. So when we get back, we're gonna start fulfillment. This is the final revision and da da da. So 
It was a good first Maker Fair, and we're gonna tear this stuff down now. Mark. What? All right. It's over. It is over. You can go home and drink now. Yes. You can lay naked in the bed and watch Star Trek.